thank you for stopping by my channel. Make sure you subscribe, click that bell, double click it so you get notifications on all, and while you're at it, make sure your phone has notifications turned on. Hi beauties, it's Jean Persani with Beauty and the Stamper. Today we're gonna make a technique card. I'm thinking about a technique Tuesday, since it is Tuesday. And we're gonna be using this large sunflower from the Celebrate Sunflower set. And then we're gonna use this Let's Celebrate You. So let's go ahead and get started. The technique we're gonna focus on today is called a spotlight technique. It's very pretty. I've got my Memento Tuxedo Black ink. I've got a sheet of Whisper White Thick. It is cut at five and a half, scored at four and a quarter. So this is what we come up with. Then you're going to um, burnish it down and then we will reopen it because we're going to use this base as the card. So the technique is really pretty. It's going to give you dimension without even having uh, to put additional layers. I do have a stitched circle and I also have a piece of Whisper White and a piece of crushed curry. So let's go ahead and do that. On that Whisper White, let's go ahead and stamp that with the Let's Celebrate You. And we're gonna go right in the center. There we go. We're going to set that off to this side. Actually, what I'll do while I have this out, I'm just going to go ahead and get my stamp and seal. And let's go ahead and get that on there. Just very lightly put it on there. I know some people have been having a little bit of trouble. And if you do have trouble, um, I know Stampin' Up! has replaced any that seem to be not very well. They are very good at doing that. And then I'm going to just put this right in the middle. Ooh, not like that. <laughs> A little bit over more. There we go. Now we'll set it off to the side. And it looks like I got a little bit of an overlay. You could, um, just going to use my little mini trimmer, but you could use just a pair of paper snips as well and get that. Perfect. It cuts so teeny tiny. I love it. All right. So we've got that. Now we're going to take that big sunflower and we want to find the way that we want it. And we're going to just ink that all up. You can just get it all good and inked up there. And then we're going to stick that right in the center. Look at how pretty that is. All right, now the next part, I'm gonna get a scratch piece of paper here. We are gonna ink this all up again. Then we're going to take our little spotlight here and we're going to figure out where we want to spotlight that. And I think I want to kind of get it a little bit in the center, but kind of in this area here. We're just going to push that down. And there we go. We've got some nice brown in there that we'll be able to do. And then I've got some yellow Stampin' Blends as well. And I've got the Light and Dark Daffodil Delight and the Light and Dark Mango Melody. And we're gonna color that in. Now we're gonna color that in using just this little, oh, that's not good. That one is a little bit dried out there. Okay, 
that's better. So I'm just going to go around in certain areas and give it a little bit of texture there. And all the way around. And starting with the lightest color, you can color in whatever you'd like. There you go. And whatever you'd like, you just want to make sure this gets all colored in and all the leaves are going to be nice and filled because there you can see on here there are no spots even though it looks like there's going to be spots there aren't any but I'm saving that color for um, the darker because we definitely want to give it again dimension And it is just a beautiful little sunflower there. And the reason this is called spotlighting is because we're going to um, obviously spotlight the color. Okay, so I think we're good there. And you can go in here as well if you'd like, whatever you think actually going to go to the other side because we can always go darker on here but I'll at least get the light colored in and now using some of that mango melody this one is the darker one and we're going to go in here And just because the colors don't match doesn't mean they won't blend. They're going to blend beautifully. And you can leave some open spaces um, for blending because we're going to go in there with a, a mango melody again. And you can just see we're filling this all in. And then here you can go a little bit darker. And you can just continue on. Ooh, look at that. All right, now we're gonna go in with uh, the light mango melody. And this is where you can really start to blend any of that color in there and you can see it just has so much I mean doing the whole flower would be beautiful as well but I think the contrast is just going to be amazing and then we'll pull some of this in there as well And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take, and I don't want that white showing, so we're just going to go all the way around so that there's no white showing at all because I want that spot to be colored, the whole entire thing. So any that might show white, we want to get rid of that. Alrighty. I'm going to bring in a little bit of a brown color here, and this is called bronze. So we'll bring in a little bit of bronze, and I'm actually going to use the little one, and we'll put some, just add some of those dots in here. And so that it gives it some of that brown. There we go. All right.
right. So we're going to move this over and we're going to do this Let's Celebrate You. And we will again put this down with the stamp and seal, just a light hand. You don't need to be heavy handed on this at all. And we're just going to line this right up. I'm going to make it a little bit higher. There we go. And then I'm going to get some little Stampin' Dimensionals. We're going to put those on the back. Just a few. And now we're going to find that area that matches up perfectly. And you'll see that now you've got that beautiful spotlight. Isn't that pretty? Alrighty, so we've got that. I'm gonna burnish this down again one more time. You can burnish the back side if you don't want to mess anything up. I'm going to push that down. And then, of course, we need to bring in some little bits of bling. Still have not found my take your pick tool. We're just going to put a few here and there. There we go. And then I'll put... Another one down here, and one more right up here. And there we go. That is our technique card. It's called Spotlighting. You'll be able to find this on my blog, and I'll have a tattoo. Uh, a tattoo. <laughs> I'll have a tutorial of this as well on my blog. So check it out, and I hope to see you guys soon. If you want to order anything I've used today, that will be listed on my blog and down here as well. And I hope you guys like it. If so, give me a big thumbs up, and make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any of my tutorials. Have a wonderful day. Bye! <music>